Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're checking out the Loudon Brewing Company's Love Loudon Amber Ale. All I know about them is that they're a family-owned uh, brewery. They're located in Loudoun County, obviously. Uh, more like Percival area. I've never actually been to the brewery, but I've, I've seen pictures of the brewery. It's like a small house. It's got a really deep kind of like honey color to it. Mm -hmm. Like a honey brown. Malty, but not super malty. Yeah, it smells like sweet malt. Maybe a little bit of nuttiness in there. So far, so good. Bottoms up. Okay. Ooh, very malty. Yeah, again, that sweet malt shines right through. That's definitely the key player here. A little bitter. A little bit, yeah. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, that's pretty good. And a bit of kind of roasty nuttiness in the background. Five and a half percent. Uh, no IBU. I'm gonna guess it's probably around 50, 55, something like that. Just enough bitterness to kind of set off the sweet uh, kind of caramel maltiness and honey that you're getting out of it. It's just right. It's really balanced. Yeah. There's lots of body to it too. Yeah. 5.5 um, percent. I mean that's definitely take a few I mean, I checked their their Instagram page for like a hot second. It, it didn't look like they were like producing crazy, like, you know, you see some Instagrams and like Aslan's Instagram, it looks like all fancy. And they got the Photoshop cans and everything like that. It didn't look like that at all. It just looked like, you know, regular pictures from regular brew people, which is fine. A brewery that we just recently went to that shall go unnamed, um, you know, we weren't impressed at all. So, and they have a similar Instagram. So, I don't know. Yeah. Can't judge a book by its cover, apparently. Yeah, impressive. We might have to go out to these guys and get in touch and do like a major review on them. I was just about to say, we might have to go and check them out. This is pretty good. Well, I good guess. job, guys. Oh, this is a fantastic, uh, this is a fantastic amber ale. You guys did a really good job. This is very nice. Yeah, it's not as um, basic, I guess, as I was expecting it to be. It has some character. Yeah. Yeah, it has and a I little like bit that. of character. I was expecting, judging by like the Instagram page and everything, it was going to be a little bit basic yeah. or, you know, a little bit like, uh, meh, meh, ho hum. Yeah. Uh, like a lot of amber ales are. But this one actually kind of steps outside the bounds just a little bit and brings something new to the table. And that's awesome. Well, that does it for us. Thanks for tuning in. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends, and gently tap that bell button for notifications when new videos come out. Until next time, stay crafty. Cheers. Brewed, okay, oh, I was saying so. Brewed for Loudoun County Brewery Company in Leesburg by Beltway in Sterling, so. Oh, because they can't brew on premises, probably because yeah. they don't have the capacity, because I was gonna say, it's a little house if you look That's, at the pictures. Yeah. Loudoun. Yeah. Loudoun. That sounds elvish. Loudoun. <laughs> that reminds me of like tattoos from the 50s. <laughs> like, like the mom tattoo? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> This is Jose. You know Jose. Yeah. Wait, Down Society is back again? They're back. With Mike? No, I don't think oh. so. Those drums are doing things. Yeah, Jose. Hell yeah, that's sick. Hey guys, back again. Today we're checking out Loudon Brewing Company's Love Loudon. I don't know if it's called Love Loudon. I think it just it looks. Says, it says it. Look it up on your phone real quick. Okay. Off to a great start. Broccoli Festival. What? What the hell is a broccoli festival? Do I want to go to a broccoli festival? No. Is it like about broccoli, like like the mac and cheese festival, or is it like just called broccoli festival and it's like music and stuff? You oh. hipster kids and your music these days. Get off my lawn, damn you.